is the time to get down. Overseas too, Vic. Here we go. Good morning. Wake up, it's a brand new day. Let's get down on the good news train. Have your morning coffee with Mario. Come on, y'all. It's the end of the year. Time to move. Get your stretch on. Get your move on. Get your move on. I dress for the occasion. Got my holiday colors. Mr. Allen is in the house. You can hear him out. Yeah, be cool. Be cool. Just move with the group. No funk in here to beat. Wait to sleep. Let's just do what we can. a sign of the conditioning now that I can actually get through the uh, lead-in music, which is so long, so long. And so I say, welcome everyone to Morning Coffee. <laughs> yes, here I am. And got to give it up also for my partner in crime, because while I may have built this ship, I don't drive it. It is driven by the the, the what I call the major multitasker on steroids, ladies and gentlemen, Victor Allen, my partner in crime. And my steroids are in my coffee. Can I get some? <laughs> hey, look, so man. I can get me some. Hey, man, hey, look. The bulk well, up. Hey, man, wonder if all of a sudden this unbelievable report from all affiliates says, you know what? Americans have been digesting in their diet a minimum of 1% of steroid inclusion in their foods and products over the last 30 years. How would you feel? 
I wouldn't be surprised because you know it's a bunch of toxins. Just like that's why I don't drink water. Just go straight with booze. <laughs> wow, that's Just an endorsement. You, water, wait, have you seen what water? Minute. Have you seen what that does to hardwood there, floors? There's ten and rust pipes. Wait a minute. There are ten year olds <laughs> and fifteen year olds watching this, and you're telling them don't I'm drink water. I'm telling it rust pipes. <laughs> Just remember that. Okay, people in Montana have good clean water, right? Well, yeah. Don't get me started because we're supposed to be on a good tip. Even though I do, you know, as part of the show, we have good news, bad news, and the other shit. And there's a bunch of stuff to talk about. It, but it's also the holiday season. So will there be a bitch session or an appreciation session today? Well, that's that gets to my lead-in for the day. Because right. my lead-in for the day is, does anyone else wish that the impeachment hearings would go on a holiday vacation? There it goes the bitch Is session. anybody else? I'm just saying. <laughs> wait, wait. No, I'm just saying. No. Because it's messing with my vibe, you guys. I'm trying, okay. Like yesterday, you guys may have noticed you were a part of my Facebook community. I was posting, 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 posting. Because as stuff, co- what happens is, the way I do it, you guys, is that whenever I read stuff, when stuff comes across my desk or my phone or whatever we want to call it, my world, then I comment on it to you all. And so I was posting, posting, posting. So there's a bunch of political postings, Nick, and things happening around the world because there's a bunch of bad shit that's been happening. But I don't know if I want to talk about that because I already have my usual stress of the holidays, <laughs> which is the one that we're used to, right, Vic? There's a certain stresses that we're used to for the holidays. And so I want to get focus on those. <laughs> I want to focus on those, and I'm finding the hearings are messing with my vibe. Okay, they just oh, I don't know about you guys. I'm I'm smoking, but the hearings, you know, are sort of messing with my vibe. So I and they're going to keep on. I think they're talking about doing stuff before. It's, what's today's date? It's the ninth. Okay. Can they take a break for like till after New Year's and let us just? I don't know. Let me ask you something. About 20 years ago, did you cover the Clinton impeachment like you're covering it now? We didn't have to. to, to then we didn't. We had where, TV. Where were we you? We had cable. Where, I, what what okay, were you doing back then? I've only been covering what you've been covering. <laughs> where, so you can answer the same question. Oh, I can ask you. So, I, so listen, you were you. there when, when you Here's were part my, of the unveiling. Here's and, this. When it was on TV and they kept showing that screenshot, if you want to call it, Monica Lewinsky, bright eye, can't wait to say, hey, Mr. President. That's the only thing I saw and I said. Oh, well, it's because so it's a visual. <laughs> so it's, so that's that messed change. up because it was a visual. <laughs> so, See, because I, I we know what Monica it. had been accused of. So Remember I now. kept visualizing. <laughs> <See>? <laughs> I kept. Yeah, right. So did I follow the day to day? It's an indictment on myself, of course, on me. No, I didn't because you know what we were doing? We were having parties. Well, that's what... <laughs> right. I, so, <laughs> so, so, and... Did you cover the Clinton impeachment? Like no, did, did, did you cover? I'm back to that. If I, I don't cover anything you don't cover. You're reporting it okay, on your regular series. This is my partner, series. everybody. This is my partner, okay? When I went on camera the first time, I had to ask him to run the camera. <laughs> right. Okay, that's how it started, that's okay? right, right. <laughs> You, you, uh, listen, I've already said I didn't cover it. Mitch mean cover it, watch it. I wish they I would did. go on vacation. <laughs> so anybody else let me know because I'm tired. Okay, here's the thing. So they're having hearings. They had hearings. They're having hearings today. I watched a little this morning, and I was like, well, I don't want to talk about that. I mean, there's stuff to talk about. But I was like, oh, jeez. You know, I had to put on some music and stuff, so I don't know, you guys. I did. I'm. T- I think we got to take a break from the impeachment hearings, sort of. I don't know. See, I want you to be aware, but man, this is gonna mess with the holiday vibe. All right, I'm smoking, but it's not. <laughs> See, I'm just saying. I just want you to know, I'm noticing it's not good for my holiday spirit. Mm-hmm. Watch the damn impeachment hearings. All right. <laughs> All right, you guys. So, you know, we got a bunch of announcements because things are coming up. First of all, 
a bunch of scheduling stuff. And I some of it I don't even know as of yet because Victor. Mm-hmm. So, Vic, yeah. you said that you might not be available on Twice. Tuesday. No. I don't, no, I, can, I've, I didn't send you the information to say I'm confirmed, so no. I'll be at a special you know, coverage of a show. I think it's called Black and Blue. And WACP is uh, sponsoring panel. Oh, it's like, oh, oh, yeah, it's all that, ooh, man. Ooh. <laughs> Wait, don't try to understate that. Well, I'm a, we're gonna I, I'm, we're gonna cancel the quiet. St- no, 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 because I think I'm gonna do it by myself. I think I'm gonna do Quiet Storm by myself you, as a get, one camera shoot. You probably get more fans, and it'll probably tell you they always want to. We watch won't have you. any special effects and no videos, and they're gonna go like, "We didn't need that. We just wanted more." All right, so Quiet Storm will be here this Tuesday. I'm gonna run it alone, solo, because Vic will be gone. So that means no videos and no effects. Just this shot right here, <laughs> and me playing music. Listen. This Watch shot this. right here, Watch me this. playing music. That's all it's going to be Watch Tuesday that. night. Now, look at that, you guys. As I pan over, you see that screen behind you? What would that screen show if he did put up a video? Pornhub. Let's <laughs> see what I'm saying. You got to see what my search is. <laughs> right. Really? Really? Because remember, I bet, I bet you if you poll your own people and say, here's the videos I would be checking out. Here's the links of which ones I will be uh, covering, but I won't play them. You can play them yourself. Well, I, the- I, well, no, because we, because we're gonna be back. Okay, okay, we're gonna be here Christmas Eve. Okay, so wait, so Tuesday, because Vic, that's a good idea. But I'll save that. I'll yeah. save that for Christmas Eve. Yeah. Because so Tuesday I'm by myself. So now Vic's, Vic's gonna be out doing a NAACP event. <laughs> <laughs> what, you know what? The NAACP event. I think it's going to be going out. And I'm going to do Quiet Storm on Tuesday night because I got a bunch of great music, some holiday music, some old, some good stuff, you guys. So it's going to be cool. One camera shoot right here, us and the music. Mm-hmm. Tuesday night, come be part of that, okay? Now, next week, morning coffee's canceled because I got to go into the knife next That's Monday. Right. That's right. Getting that hurt. You know, I don't mind. See, people say, Mario's TMI. I have no wife. I have no children. I have no job, no employer. I have a job. It's this. But, you know, I, first of all, Victor Allen has been the, the driving force encouraging me. Uh, plus, my friends reaching out to me who keep saying, you know, me sharing my stuff makes a big deal, deal to them. Yep. And so, ideally... My attitude is a little cavalier sometimes, but, you know, not crazy, but just trying to be positive and spiritual. So I share my journey at the encouragement of my friends like Victor Allen. And you got to ask him, why, Vic? Yeah. (laughs) Why am I sharing this? (laughs) Because it's the obvious thing that sometimes is taken for granted. It's that because you happen to come from the healthcare and medical field, that you're also now one that they're going to be treating. So you bring insight and wisdom because it's interesting to have that. Not many of us have that where somebody's, we're usually going to the doctor who's giving an, a 15 minute appraisal and say, okay, bye, <laughs> your time is up, see me. But now you're the one who is now the patient. So you bring this wisdom and experience and what you have done, and that, this is real talk, you've been, you've been impressed by the attention to detail of your past surgeries and what that means. So there's this empowerment that you can share, not only that you're just going on surgeries, but watch this. How often do you go watch the surgeries of uh, the follow-up of Tiger Woods who had about 12 (coughs) or 14? You don't care. (laughs) You said just golf and win championships. But you're not Tiger Woods. You're Mario Hemsley, medical, pediatrician. (sighs) Advocate for those who okay. are depressed and oppressed. Yes. That's right. A yes, man who has Vic. more hair than I, I do. I am. And gone to Howard. Somebody. That's right. Well, I went to West L.A. Junior College. You should be proud of sharing those things because I've shared them and more. most people have turned it off. All right. So now you guys see why I share too much information. So this morning will be another example of that because I was posting last week about the fact that I had to go have a biopsy. And 
prostate biopsy, which is common for a lot of men. People, Some people say, Mars not funny. So I'm not joking about the biopsy, you guys. I'm joking about the things to get ready for the biopsy because sometimes things happen and they're so stupid that you have to share them. Now, people say, Mario's TMI. I say, well, I have no wife and no children. <laughs> so, as part of Victor Allen's ongoing encouragement, I want to share this experience with you guys because I talked a little bit about it. Now, when you go to have a state biopsy, they want you to prep your bowels, which means they want you to clear out your bowels. Says, I know, that's all right. So, as part of that, you have to have a like an enema. Now, even though my woman would probably have delighted in this, <laughs> she was gone to work. So I had to do it myself. Now, I want y'all to understand, as a doctor, I've ordered hundreds of enemas. Hundreds. Just so many enemas I can't just enema, you know, in enema in because that's the ER. So I want you to take a look at this wonderful enema picture right here, Vic. See, show them the enema. Okay. So this is the way it comes. It's not expensive. They, I get, they got the two-pack. <laughs> they got the two-pack. Okay. So I'm sharing this. It's a TMI moment. It's okay because you deserve it because you watch this shit. <laughs> so that morning, I'm there, and I'm trying to get myself to enema. If you could just get a visual. <laughs> <laughs> And so I insert, you see the bottle right here, Vic? I insert yeah. the bottle, mm -hmm. and I'm squeezing the bottle, and nothing's happening. And nothing's coming out. I'm going like, what the hell? I'm squeezing the bottle, squeezing the bottle. I am. So finally I pull the bottle out, and I realize I still have the cap on. I figured you did. <laughs> I figured you did, bro. <laughs> Look, hey. See? Right. And that's so stupid. I sat there, and I laughed at myself. It's so stupid. It's so stupid. that you know, I'm so stupid, I have to share with you. So give it up. Yeah. Because after that, I then removed the cap, <laughs> reinserted, the, and then completed it. Now, I, I want you all to know, it was successful and it was good. Saw that. But I had asked some of my girlfriends, some of my exes prior to this, so I said, you know, I asked them how it was having something like that up their ass. <laughs> oh, no. You and they said it. it's a little uncomfortable at first, but you get used to it. <laughs> whoa. 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 Wow. Uh, anyway, you know, I'll let you draw your own inferences <laughs> from that. But anyway, I want <laughs> you to know, after all that, doing that shit, I get to the hospital, and they tell me, because I didn't take the antibiotic, that they're rescheduling me. I said, the papers, I said, just give me the antibiotic here. They said, no, we wanted three hours ahead. So after all that shit, not oh, literally, man. pun, forget the pun, I still didn't even get to do the damn biopsy. So the biopsy's now, and I was joking with my, you know, my urologist, because I had told him I had, I expected him to say, man, you're really clean, because I said I wanted him to have a wonderful work environment. <laughs> So I was joking with him, see. That's why the urologists, they all think I'm crazy anyway. So it's not that I'm laughing at the biopsy, because I'm not. I'm laughing at me as a 30-year pediatric hospitalist, intensivist, you know, part of a quintuplet team. Can't figure out how to get the fleet's enema box open. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> so, all right, all right. So, Vic, we got the full show today. Yes, sir. Uh, what you got? <laughs> well, I'm still recovering from the <laughs> right. thoughts of the enema. Right. <laughs> uh, um, you know, nothing spectacular, but what I'm going to do is cover, you know, some of the uh, sports that we already know about, of course. But I'm going to do a focus on what I believe is disrespect in a certain area of participation in sports that probably needs to get more... Um, support and that is skateboarding and longboarding that's my primary feature and we'll discuss why we'll cover why did we not watch a fight when somebody says you know i gained more weight maybe that's the reason why you didn't watch the fight also will ad anthony D davis who drops 50 on minnesota I i'm wondering Will the duel of LeBron and Anthony go all time? We're going to discuss that. And put your money at the Ooh. college playoff um, championship. Money time now. Don't wait until later. 
Also in Hot Picks, the sexy criminals that sometimes you just tend to forgive. And should we? And are we a forgiving nation, community, village? And would you? We'll find out more about the conditions mm. which you got to choose on. That'll be it, man. Mm. That's a lot. Yeah, That's a lot. And I got the good news and the bad news and the other shit. And really, uh, let me see what I got. Well, mainly... Uh, the officials are now listing the, the pot vape brands that are really the ones associated with the U.S. outbreak. There's a big slowing up. <laughs> well, let's put it like this. Cannabis stocks are not doing well. Well, probably because of the, 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 the processes that are still so new, making everything a pain in the ass. And Willie Nelson says he's not smoking, but he's still using pot. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. Bravo, Willie. And, of course, on the good news and the bad news and the other shit, I'm going to take you to my Facebook page and show you some of the things that I was obsessing on over the weekend. Yeah. Hey, Vic, I want to think we need to make it clear. So next week, Monday, no morning coffee. I'm going under the knife, so right. won't be none of that happening next week. Well, then how would you do Tuesday the day after the knife? See, I don't know. <laughs> right. I think I might be strong. Oh, no, you did that but before. But I take it. We're taking it off. See, I know. Yeah. I know. So next week we're taking it off. Yeah. You can do it from your bedside if you want, bro. <laughs> do it from. See, I, you guys. You see how important you are to me. How you make me feel whole. Right. You make me feel whole. No, no. And even on my surgical bed, right. I want to come to you play out of music. my dedication play to my music. online community. P play your music and say, here's the music that keeps me calm. This is my personal, you know. Music to enema by. The, the, re the rehab. <laughs> and this is how I'm chilling. And watch how many people. Watch. All right. So that's okay. Forget it. No show next <laughs> week. But we will return. Uh, with the season finale, Monday, December 23rd, we're going to do a special season finale, even though it's the, it's the, by then it'll be winter. Alexa, when is winter? In the United States, winter begins on Saturday, December 21st, 2019. Okay, so it'll already be winter. But right now, believe it or not, it's still fall. It's still fall. And so we'll be doing our show that we'll do a special. It'll be a different show, right, Vic? We don't know what it'll be. Right. We don't know what it'll be because it could be anything. <laughs> it could be anything. It could be any late. And then we're going to do a Quiet Storm Christmas Eve special. That's right because I already got permission. <laughs> <laughs> I already got permission for a Quiet Storm Christmas Eve special. And so we'll be here on Christmas Eve. Vic, are you staying on your Christmas budget? <laughs> what you talking about? I didn't know I had a budget. I didn't know I had money. That's what everybody's telling me. <laughs> Somebody's like, can I send you my budget? Yeah. Because yeah. I posted some budget encouragement, some wonderful encouraging budget. Budget for the bills, yeah. yeah. Okay, but before yeah. we do that, let me show you this. So I, did, I went back, you guys, for the holidays, and I did a... Holiday memory slideshow animation featuring photos from the holiday season of 2016. So, Vic, this is New Year's, right? And also, we had a uh, what is that? A, 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 we had a New Year's Eve thing, and we had a Christmas thing. Oh, you talking about last year? No, 2016. Oh, 2016. So Got this you. is the right. 2016 slideshow. All right. So I don't know what you're gonna see. Cause I just I just went and got the photos. Be right back. I need to get a refill of my car.
you guys but it's cold uh even here i know across the nation it's been cold uh for example i've heard that you know alexa what's the weather in pittsburgh in pittsburgh pennsylvania it's 52 degrees fahrenheit with showers today you can look for rainy weather with a high of 55 degrees and a low of 46 degrees well i mean that's better than well <laughs> Alexa, doing well. What's the weather in View Park, California? Currently, in View Park, California, it's 60 degrees Fahrenheit with mostly sunny skies. Today, you can expect partly sunny weather with a high of 67 degrees and a low of 50 degrees. How you like that? Take that, Pittsburgh. <laughs> Take that. All right, you guys, are you ready for some news? Uh. 